Yes, the all familiar sound of me almost dying, or possibly dying soon, in the world of horrors. And the game has been updated. Uh, I think we're playing on 0.9.15 H1 now or something. I don't know. I have a new color palette as well. It's literal eye cancer, so I hope everyone will enjoy that. Um, what's going on here? We are a burn victim. And we've nicotine roofs. Wait a second. Yeah, we've. Wait a second. My, my girl play through. I died in that, didn't I? I? I thought it was a dude last time. How did that happen? Am I. I look very girly. Let's take a fucking look. I am a fucking girl. I have tits and a skirt. That's what you need to be a girl, right? Um. Let's see. Uh. Close. Bookworm, windstopper, sport jacket, teen, teen witch too. Pretty good looking boogaloo, I would say. We're gonna go with that one. God, I enjoyed. Looking good, yeah, as good as you can look with, like, severe burn marks and bandages on your face, which try to, apparently, separate from your entity or something. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. So apparently we've switched genders since last time. That happens every now and then. And then I guess um, let's take a bath. We need extra. Oh, good lord, that back. Um, whew, we need extra reason. Jeez, yeah, I need to take a cold shower right now, I think. Um, open the curtains? No? Yes, let's do. And start a new mystery. Last time we did this one, I can't even remember which one it was. Today, we're gonna go left to right, or I guess in general, in this, in this uh, playthrough. So we're gonna go for the Chilling Chronicle of a Crimson Cape. Alright. The Chilling Chronicle of a Crimson Cape. A new game is spreading among your friends. Fortnite. No. I dare to stay in an unused school restroom after classes. Hmm. Just like in my hentai, maybe? I dare to meet Akamanto. Who is this Akamanto girl and will she do what I want her to do with me? Or will she just devour me? Not in the way I'd like her to do. What was originally a harmless fun has turned deadly. The body of a boy was found last week. I guess sucked dry or something? The school principal has banned the game, but that made only made it more popular. You know, if someone died, I don't know if that if it still would be that popular, to be honest. Akamanto must be stopped before another kid is killed. Let's investigate this mystery. One of my friends says he doesn't believe in curses, and he intends to complete the dangerous dare. Uh, the man in a red cape got a gossip about the current mystery. How do I do that? How do I get a gossip? Going downtown? We have zero funds. Do we have anything in my inventory to... Uh, God. It's really bad when I don't play this game for a week. I I just... Apparently I forgot everything about how to play it. Well, you know what? It doesn't matter. Travel to the apartments. Neighbor. Costume to enter. Chance for an ally. I have a lot of... Apparently in my first playthrough I had a little bit of Doom to spare. I should have used up more Doom. Okay. Oh! You knock on your friend's door and wait. I'm really busy today. Let's hang out some other... Okay. Okay. Yeah, my, f my friend doesn't want to help me apparently. Um, maybe in the village they can help me? No? Okay, let's... Uh, study the current mystery. Oh! Recruit allies, learn gossip. Oh god, what is... Um... Latest gossip, ask to join you, observe, share a creepy story. Or, I don't know what this one does. Force to help you. Okay, it doesn't tell me here, but here it says force to help me. Okay, we need to learn some gossip. Uh, latest gossip from this guy. I keep hearing a wailing sound coming from the third stall in the girl's bathroom. Uh, what's going on there? <laughs> Have you heard about this computer program, Dad? Yeah, what? What does it do? Yesterday she told me she saw it again. Who? Man, I want to recruit her. Oh, her! She has come to school since last week. Okay, um... She a creepy story. Does it cost me 5 XP or do I get 5 XP? Where's my... Here we go. 7 out of 100. It costs me 5 XP. D-O-Y seems visibly shaken by a story. Oh, her name is Doi. Not D-O... It's not even why, it's I, D-O-I. It's just a story, right? Let's call her Dio. Let's try to recruit Dio. 
If what you're saying is true, we have no time to lose. Can I recruit more? Can I get like a harem of girls? Sorry, I don't have time for games. Yes, student B wants to join me too. And student C as well. <laughs> what can they do? Minus one strength, minus, uh, plus one dexterity, minus one luck. Fucking Hachi and goddamn Chi Chiharu. Talk? Uh, Chiharu smiles faintly. Okay. And you, Hachi? Hachi looks at you and blushes. Good thing we're together in this, right? I... He must really have the hots for me. Considering that, that I'm wearing bandages and stuff. Or maybe that's his fetish, who knows? That would be very creepy. Uh, and Doi? Doi shivers, or rather Dio, sorry. Is it me or did it suddenly get colder? Uh, usually you ask, is it me or are you happy to see... Nine. No, 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 wait. It's Are you happy to see me or is that like... Uh, a, a wrench in your pants or something, right? Sorry, I butchered that one. <laughs> Let's... Why would we wait? Wait for what? Exactly. Let's observe her. Kohaku is reading a horror manga about spirals. They look they look fine. Can we force her to help us? Um, the student shoves me away and escapes screaming for help. Our combined intimidation value is 46.30. Okay, I guess we have to... What do we have to do now? <laughs> huh? Investigate the school, I guess? Alright, there's four of us now. There's no way this is gonna fail, right? While you walk through the crowded space, someone bumps into you and quickly apologizes. Not again. My perception check was a success though. They stole my wallet. I quickly grabbed their arm and they drop it before disappearing in the crowd. Little do they know there's nothing in there, but it's still got the experience. Okay. Uh, I've reported it to my principal who promises he will take care of it. Oh wait a second, I still need to gather gossip apparently. With your friends safe for now, you should look into the legend. Maybe records in the city's library make mention of Akomanto. No, 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 give me a second. I need to learn more gossip. Here we go. Did you hear? There's a cliff nearby with strangely shaped holes. Is that all she's gonna say? Can we recruit her? I don't have time for games. Fuck off then. She notices me and smiles. Thank you, Senpai. She looks nervous. God, we're wrecking up a lot of doom. Oh, please! More doom, no! I don't like doom! I just want to complete this quest! Oh, let's go up to, like, 51. Okay, fuck it, I'm not gonna get it like that. Oh, shit! What, what can we... I should probably leave her alone? Why? What's wrong with her? Set up a telescope? I don't have a telescope? Okay. Okay, we're not gonna get ending A for this one then. Apparently we're gonna get ending B, I don't know. <laughs> Who cares? Let's investigate downtown. Jesus Christ. Uh, the roads seem to twist and turn when I'm not looking, trapping you in this neighborhood. I'm gonna get lost. How much doom will this give me? Let's find out. Two doom. I spend hours trying to find a way out. Finally, completely exhausted, you end up on the main street as, as the passage to the blighted neighborhood slowly closes behind me. It is literally a fucking Jojo reference, isn't it? Ah, <laughs> oh, okay. Go back to the school again. All of the missing girls were apparently members of the school swimming team. Again? Is it the creepy janitor again? Maybe someone saw the kidnapper stalking them. Check out the school's pool area. Um. No? No one here. Again, so let's investigate. Let's see, as I enter the school gym, it's a it's a doll again. Uh yeah, against my better judgment, I have to see the white half-eaten corpse. Great. Okay, and now we need to go to the hospital, because one of the articles mentions a young doctor who performed life-saving surgery on a victim of a brutal assault. Um, the assault happened in the toilet stall. Maybe he still works at the hospital and can share information. Have we found out anything about the school swimming team, or was that a bust? Apparently it was a bust. Okay, someone has been branding the patients with occult symbols. Possibly a very bad doctor. <laughs> Assume the worst. <laughs> Branded like cattle. Are they preparing a feast for the Eldritch Masters? Plus 4% doom. I guess I'm gonna find out what happens when you hit 100 doom in this playthrough. You learned that the doctor suddenly left the hospital after the latest murder. Taking all of the records with him. Why would you do that? 
That's not the only bad news. My friend didn't come to school today and another body has supposedly been found. Well, let's go to school and investigate, I guess. Okay, but you're stopped by a girl you haven't seen in months. How could you? She died in an accident. It's the stalker girl! And I'll thumbnail for today, I guess, since that looks kind of cool. Um, let's see. Apparently a good way to sell two items, or sell items for funds, or, or discard two items for quests, is to look for weapons in an easy fight, and then just discard them, like two branches or something. Which makes sense, you know? I, I don't have a weapon with me, I believe. Do I? I have nothing in my inventory. Um... No, wait. Here we go. Yeah, there's nothing in my inventory. Okay, so we're gonna look for a makeshift weapon. It's like in the support stuff here. Look for an improvised weapon and... Can't dodge, so we're gonna kick her. No? Just for good measure? Nothing I can do really here? Nothing really? We can meditate, but I don't want to do that. So she just hit us for two all damage. That's not good. That's not good at all. Okay, now we can try to dodge and attack with weapon. Nope. Nope. Since it's dexterity based, it needs a lot of time apparently, so... We can't even kick. We can't even do anything while we dodge. Oh, great. Fucking amazing shit. Okay, we're, we're gonna save this sequence. Hopefully it saves altogether. We might die to this encounter, you know. We might not be able to, to clear her. Or we have to use our desperate stand or something or whatever. Yeah, desperate struggle. Doubles all damage dealt during this turn, but... Well... Ask your ally to distract the enemy. If succeeded, faster combat action for the duration of this encounter. If failed, lose a random ally. Base chance 70%. Great! <laughs> Run away, but a doom penalty of 5%, and I'm kind of committed now. So, uh... Hmm. Clap bow and pray, I wonder if I will ever use them. Uh, rather, clap and bow, praying, obviously, it doesn't make much sense here. Oh, you know what? Let's... Let's double our damage. And that would be four. So if I hit these two, I will survive. I did survive, okay. Wait, what's that? Pick it up. It's an occult diary. What can I do with this? Use minus 3% doom. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> it's just an easy minus 3%. The principal has ordered the school to be closed down for the investigation. Okay, so we need to go to downtown now doing... Sometimes it's a little bit nonsensical where you have to go and what you have to do. The game is very solid. I do like the stories behind it. I like the gameplay. I like, like, the different mechanics behind it. But the way it's all glued together... ...takes a lot more work in my opinion. Hearing footsteps, you turn around. Behind you stand a woman in a, in a sweater. Natural beauty, yes, this is exactly what I need. You shudder seeing the weird woman reach into her pocket and grabbing a nasty looking knife. Pretty face, mind if I borrow it? You do realize I have bandages on my face because I'm a horrible disfigured burn victim apparently. Because I killed a creepy janitor in our school. It's an aspiring model with her face, um... It doesn't look quite right, does it? We need to run away from this one. <laughs> How do I... I ran away. How do I... How do I heal up again? Is there a way to heal up? Like, hospital? Enter? Funds for items and heal injuries? Okay. Um, enter the doctor's office? How can I help you today? I'm fucking almost dead, dude. Help me, please. Just heal me up, senpai. I feel like the skull is observing my every move. I stole some painkillers. Um, additional actions available on the injury cards. Oh, wait a second. These ones, then. We can treat... Ah, we can treat this shit. Modern medicine can't help with the nicotine withdrawal. Sad. 
They could help me with my burn. But... Hmm... I don't have any funds, apparently. Maybe I should have sold the diary. Let's go to the pharmacy, though. I know it costs funds as well, I guess. Oh, look, an empty bottle. We can... We could bottle our bath water. Exit without buying anything. Is this gonna make us crazy? No. We are at 73% doom. I'm gonna hit that today. <laughs> uh, let's go to school. There's always gonna be one big fight in the end, right? I'm gonna die to this one, but... Yeah, whatever. Uh, with the trail going growing cold, it might be time for a different approach. Could a similar case have occurred in the past? A trip to the library might be a good idea. Study issues of local newspapers or it's a waste of time? Let's study them. We rolled a success. Near closing time, I stumbled upon a curious article on the last page of a local newspaper. I copied the author's name along with the address before getting ready to leave. Minus Doom and plus XP. There's no turning back now. You step into the last stall and close the door behind you. Why did I opt for trying it myself? That's not a smart thing to do, but then again, my reason is very low at this point. So let's investigate the cursed toilet. And fight, I guess. Legend. Alive. You wait in the stall, trying to be as quiet as possible. Suddenly, squish, squeak. The sound of rubber boots and an unknown liquid dripping on the towels. It's not sperm, hopefully. Squish, squeak. You can see the top of his head. He's taller than any man you've ever seen. Squish, squeak. Wait a second, Akamato is a dude? Uh, yeah, I guess, maybe. I don't care. I I'd still would, I think. Prepare yourself. The, slow the door slowly opens. Oh, it's the red cape. A masked man dressed in a red coat, clearly too tall for the ceiling, emerges from outside. Tell me! His voice sounds like a faulty radio. What do you like, red paper or blue paper? Blue never let me down, did he? <laughs> the tall man in a red coat grabs you by your neck and starts choking. It's pretty hot. You kick him and rush to the door, minus five stamina. This playthrough is over. <laughs> I hear a click coming from the door's direction. You're locked here with this crazy man. It's Akamanto. Little does he know I'm already dead. He's fighting a dead woman. Um. Sure. This fucking thing. That this. The fact that this is so expensive fucked me up so hard in this playthrough. I'm just gonna do the same thing again. Funny thing is, you will always win your battles, but you die at the end. Oh no, apparently not. You die earlier. That encounter was the final straw. Okay. I mean, that was a cursed playthrough after the latest patch, apparently. It, it, I think it broke some stuff. So I'm gonna blame uh, the patching system of this game and some bugs. And say that I could have gone on if that did ha didn't happen. I would have solved more than one mystery. How the fuck did I manage to solve four? The first time around. How did I get so fucking lucky in some encounters? Okay, let's do... Let's start a new playthrough. <laughs> I want to... I want to... Ah! I want to do an old god. And not in a literal sense of, sense of doing them, but rather fighting them. Please. Um, We're gonna keep that color palette. We're gonna do a new story, though. Continue. Apparently quick play... Oh god, look at that. It's the blue swimming suit. Swimsuit. Uh, apparently quick play is how you usually play this game, so we're just gonna hit that again. Uh, the missing stars. You've read that before. Okay, this time we are... I don't even know what our name is. Do we have a name? Um. You only see... The weird thing is you only see the name in the main menu, I think. The towering eye is our enemy, by the way, this, this time. Afiolatst. Casting spells raises doom, which doesn't bother me too much. We have two rituals, though. Also, I've learned from the last video from the comments, you cast a ritual once, and uh, it stays active for the whole duration of the playthrough. At least it should. So we're gonna cast this now, which is gonna cost us two reason. Um, cast a spell. It's an active ritual now. If allies die, we get more stats, so we need to sacrifice some of them, I guess. And we have a combat spell, an offensive spell, which costs two reason, but it deals three damage. I don't see any... How do you regain that much reason to... To ever use this, like, properly? It seems so expensive, since reason is also your health. At your last gaze, casting this doesn't cost reason. 
Oh! That's pretty cool. So we can just keep chain casting this. What are we that we can do that? Okay, let's go home. Let's go home. And oh, she looks cute. I like her. Is there anything here now? So let's uh, change our clothes. We have the transfer girl, the casual shirt, and... Oh, Teen Witch again? Yes! Not Teen Witch, but rather Team Witch! There's a reason why I'm called Lambda Delta. Oh, look at her. Damn, I like the goth Lolita style. You don't really see it that much anymore. In, uh, in Europe it was the scene girls, I think, and emo a little bit, like 15 years ago or something. That was... I enjoyed that time of my life. <laughs> <laughs> very, very uh, beautiful girls like going for that style. Not not always did it fit them, but well, do we want to take a bath? Yes, we do. However, since I'm not losing or rather missing anything yet, we're gonna go for the um, X-ray XP. Okay. And we're gonna start a mystery because as I'm already 21 minutes into this video. Inexplicable and mor morbid events have been plaguing my town for some time now. I've marked down five of them, and then I can go for the old god. Is there anyone we haven't done yet? Like the rotten report of Rancid Ramen, or the bizarre brute of the blood-curdling botanist? The spine-chilling story of school scissors, we can breeze through that if we want to, but I'd rather do the horrible history of household hell. <laughs> Sounds amazing. Horrible history of household hell. There are many old mansions around this town, Oh, 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 Manor is one of them, or zero, zero, zero Manor. Supposedly haunted by the family of four, who disappeared without a trace one summer. But is it the only tragic event that took place here? I guess we're gonna find out. Investigate the seaside location twice to complete this quest. We're gonna do this immediately. So we get the good ending, hopefully, if we survive to this. The ocean is hungry. You're stopped by a person with a knife. They look incredibly sad. It wants me, but I'm afraid I, I'm too much of a coward to do it myself. Can you help me? Talk them out of it, let them kill themselves, or fast hands. I guess stealing the knife. Where's the option to, to like, do them? Talk them out of it. Let's try. We failed. By one. Unable to convince the person, you close your eyes as they jump off the cliff. Why do they need the knife, then? <laughs> what was that? Let's investigate it again. The military exercise makes you feel safer, but are guns enough to stop the unspeakable horrors lurking out there? <laughs> plus doom. And plus reason, though. That's pretty good. Um, okay, you've learned the cliff the mansion was built on is famous for its extensive cave system. You've decided to rent some books that might help you. We got an architect's journal and the shield cover herald. Friends you've talked with are not sure where the mansion itself is located. You have to find the mansion first. A trip to the library may shed some light on it. Um... Let's inspect. An article covers a group of scientists from Tokyo. They were exploring and mapping weird cave formations found in the cliffs. The search of the missing team of scientists continues. The only clue so far is a code written on a cavern wall. 424 Hertz. And the architect's journal? One house owner, however, decided to make use of the cave tunnel. It's a natural concert hall, he claims. Hmm, and the Hertz is like a sound. Interesting, we're gonna use that later, I guess. Let's go to school and... To the library. You feel the gaze, gaze of the librarian. Pretty cool. I usually like librarians. Um, wait, do I? While we're here, let's make some notes. You decide to make some notes about subjects that could be re relevant to the case. I guess I need to investigate the school. Okay. Um... The fuck was that? I've encountered. Oh no. Hello! <laughs> For a second there, I thought the game was forgetting to give me buttons, but it wasn't done yet. That was lovely. That was lovely. I quite enjoyed that. Maybe this is gonna be our thumbnail today. Okay. The Towering Ice Prophet. Uh, people point and talk about the man on the other side of the street. He looks confused, muttering to himself while occasionally touching a festering wound on his cheek. We stop in the tracks and listen to the man's cursed incantation. We get a spell. Grow teeth. That's a new combat action bite until the end of this mystery. 
It doesn't cost reason. We might as well. Oh, it costs stamina instead of watch. Are you fucking serious? So can we take a look at our new combat action anywhere? No? Only in-fight, I guess? Okay, that's alright. We have to investigate the seaside again, apparently. Because we need to find a mansion, obviously. The old fishermen again. I decide to enter a small shady bar in the docks. Do we tr try talking to them or buying them around? Let's try talking to them this time. We failed. Asking too many questions makes everyone nervous and you're thrown out. Great. <laughs> You make it through the window. This is an abandoned mansion, your friend. This is the abandoned mansion your friends have talked about. Let's explore it. Sure. What's the worst that could happen other than us dying or growing teeth in places we don't want teeth at, like our vagina? There's a local legend about a heartbroken seamstress. One stormy night, she broke into a local inn and stitched the unsuspecting guests together. How? How do you do that without them noticing? <laughs> Her final gruesome artwork. That's just a legend, right? Rifle through the cupboard or check out the sewing machine. Let's go through the cupboard. Um, our luck check was a success and we find an item, a sewing kit. Which I think is a healing item. You've heard a weird noise coming from the locked study. You must find a key. Oh god. Let's click a mansion's room to explore it. The fuck are these rooms? Okay, it's overgrown garden first. It looks like one of the previous owners of this mansion liked to read. Does the tomes reach the ceiling? You don't have much time, but maybe you could spare some to look through the books. Uh, start with the shelves, check out the table. You don't have time for this. Maybe on the table there's gonna be a good book that they left behind. Ah, oh, we rolled a one, a natural one, so it's a success. The notes lying on the table look like the ramblings of a madman, but you can see a method in the madness. <laughs> God, it's like me writing down something. Okay, this one was a bust, so let's go for the next one. Uh, my friend has asked you to meet them at a certain secluded location. Getting there, you find a telescope with a note signed by your friend. The note tells you to look for the telescope. I have to check it out. You don't see anything at first, then you notice it. Or, then you notice it. The bloated body of Afulax. It's getting closer. Let's redo. Thank you, friend. Who, who's, who prepared that for me to look through? Asshole. Despite your best efforts, you feel like the neighborhood is starting to change. The location's threat level increases. What that? What does that even do? Um, I'm still looking for a key, apparently. Oh god. You enter the art classroom. The room is cluttered with half-finished sculptures. Let's not check out the sculpture because last time she attacked us. So let's check out the masks instead. One mask looks similar to the design you once saw in an occult book. You decide to take it with you. Plus one item. Yes, we're gonna check this out, definitely. It's a Karukosa mask. Faster spiritual actions. Can you see in it? I'm gonna equip that shit. Yes, look at us! We look amazing! Oh, now, ju now just need a choker and she would be perfect because she has a big ass hole in her face. That's like my ideal woman. Um, let's see. <laughs> I really shouldn't have said that. Not even as a joke, that's fine for you too. <laughs> okay, the study room. You aren't sure what to expect. The sturdy duo... Do so, sorry, the sturdy door to the study room opens with a creak. The dark, dusty room is empty, but something feels wrong. A faint draft, perhaps. You move the rotten carpet aside to reveal a secret passageway, cut directly into the cliff rock. I'm still missing the key, but if this leads me to the cavern system, I'm, I'm up for it. It's the underground chamber. Um, following a strange song, you discover a hidden passage that leads you to an underground chamber connected to the sea. You can't find the source of the sounds, but then it hits you. The acoustics of this place make the waves sound like the most beautiful serenade. Mesmerized, you step close to the stone altar at the end of the room. Explore some more, step closer, let's explore some more, I don't know. You try to explore the side corridors, but it's too dark if only you had some source of light. Shit. Okay, we need to step closer then. Um... <laughs> what? That's the end? Unholy chants coming from the caves connected with the mansion must have driven the family insane. With no connection to the outside world, they fed on what they had. Themselves. However, this doesn't explain the fresh corpses and wet tracks around the altar. Horrible history of household hell, ending C. We got minus doom, plus a lot of XP. Uh, plus one reason and stamina, apparently, and plus one day passes. Wait a second, I, I had the articles, I had the newspaper. The fuck? The fuck happened? What should I have done? Did I need light? The old god stirs. 
Contaminated water. There's something wrong with the tap water. It turns to frog gay. It is black and oily and glistening. Oh, that's even worse. Smelling like death. You hope it's just a temporary issue. Yeah, let's call my, like, local water, um... Water supply. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, it's a key. Shit! Okay. Well, that's one mystery done. And a nice little 30 minute video, just about. So we had to start a new playthrough. That was bound to happen. This one looks better though already. Can we level up yet? We can't level up yet. However, we look like that, so two thumbs up on my side. I hope you enjoy this too, this look of ours. It's not only Goth Lolita, it's now also slightly... Slightly... How would you describe that even? Without making it sound like a fetish. Bye everyone. Um, I'm gonna leave this world of horror behind now.